a lot of people aren't comfortable swimming in open water. I mean, you never know what lives in the water beneath your feet. The ocean holds many bizarre deep sea monsters. As you dive 140 meters underwater, you might see a mega mouth shark. Sure, they look scary, but those 50 rows of teeth are for filtering krill. The Japanese spider crab is happy to welcome you 300 meters down. These massive crustaceans are thought to live to 100 years old and are a Japanese delicacy. The frilled shark looks closer to an eel. Its needle-like teeth hook squid one half its size and its jaws can gulp them down. Even deeper is the Pacific black dragon. It uses its chin barbell as a lure to attract small fish. Another 150 meters down, we meet the vampire squid. It has bioluminescent organs called photophores that produce flashes of light, but it doesn't drink blood. It prefers free-floating debris from the surface. The deeper you go, the more alien things look. Goblin sharks are believed to be unchanged for 25 million years, basically making them living fossils. They can launch their jaws forward to grab prey. Look, here comes the blobfish. This thrilling deep sea fish was voted the world's ugliest animal by the Ugly Animal Preservation Society, but its jelly-like skin looks much more natural at 900 meters. Down here, we enter the midnight zone, where no natural light can reach. You might also pass the Tiburona Gran Rojo, or Big Red, one of the largest jellyfish in the world. The fangtooth has teeth to spare, the largest of any fish. It can't even fully close its mouth. The barrel eye looks upward through its translucent head. It recognizes the silhouette of its prey in even the most dim light. But it should watch out below for the ghost shark. Its body is covered with sensory organs that detect motion in the surrounding water. Deeper down are giant isopods, supersized crustaceans. These guys are closely related to common pill bugs. Down at 2200 meters is one of the biggest residents of the deep. At 14 meters long, the colossal squid is the largest known invertebrate. Its arms have sharp hooks, which it uses to catch prey and fight sperm whales. As we go even deeper, we enter the Hadal Zone, where life is less common. The sea devil is the quintessential deep sea anglerfish. Its bioluminescent lure attracts prey close to its massive jaws but you can still find some extreme life forms as deep as 7,000 meters under the surface, like our friend, the sea spider. It sucks up worms from the ocean floor with its proboscis. There are potentially thousands more undiscovered creatures swimming around underneath us. Who knows what else might be living down there?